Hi, this is Deepak from Badra Electronics. Today I want to introduce one more product. It's a OBD Star. So this is one of the wonderful tool what we are having in present market. Do you know one more thing? This is the first tool which cracked Delphi 2.5 ECM. So this is one of the best ECU you can do read and write via OBD. No need to connect for bench and you can't do any work for the ECM. It's one shot programming by via OBD. It's nothing but OBD star. Today I am unboxing this OBD star. Let's have a quick review about the product and each and individual option what it comes with OBD star in this complete dashboard. Let's see one by one. Now I will going to open this OBD star. So I just showed all the products what it comes in OBD star. Let's we need to study the in-depth information about this OBD star and what all the items it going to cover. And the main thing is we are having a device. So this device is a touch screen device and it comes with power button, one C type USB cable and with one uh, connector and with one USB port with a 12 volts DC socket also. And in the back side, they clearly mention all the detail about the product. It's a model is DC706. It's one of the best model what we are having right now. This uh, model is dedicated for only ECM reading and writing. And here you are having a serial number and just you will get a one stand. So using this, you can keep it on table. And if you don't want miss, you can close it also. It's very easy and handy tool. And the gripper is also very nice. It's excellent. And next coming for this one, we are having a bench cable also. So it's a bench cable. So obviously you know KTAG and KTMH, the same cable only I think, but the connector is different. So you can use this cable to read and write ECUs on bench mode only. So if you don't want to work with via OBD, so this tool is supporting for bench also. You guys don't get confused. This also supports for bench mode reading and writing also. And the same thing can low, can high, supply ground, ignition, K line, so there is no difference of, apart from this cable and next coming for this is the jumper cables so by using these jumper cables we can connect easily and it comes with all with the female sockets you can connect easily for the ECM coupler and the quality is very good and fine I never saw this type of quality in the market so this product is really good next coming for this is a P004 this uh, P004 is an extra adapter what we have got from the OBD star while doing programming we need to connect this adapter for the recommended ECUs only not for the all ECUs so and one more thing it's a P003 so this is a yellow color OBD connector and this is a gray color OBD connector so the model is P004 and here the model is P003 so these two we need to use for only on the special cases only and this is one of the OBD cable what we got from the device it's okay the quality is very good and fine and next this is a 12 volts adapter wire length is okay so this much length is on bench work only I think so so you need not to connect any adapter on via OBD mode. So if you want to work in bench mode means definitely we require this one. Why we require this one means you are not connecting for the OBD of a vehicle. You are connecting on bench OBD. So in that bench OBD you will not get 12 loads actually. For that reason you need to connect the 12 loads power supply as external. It's mandatory. So let's have a quick review about the product one by one. Let me show you this hardware first. Okay. If you open the application means you will get a Adobe, any desk, browser, calculator, the same Android version only. So let's see the Android version also. So I'm going for the Ebo device and this is the Android 5.1.1. So the Android version is not mandatory for us. Okay. The main application of this OBD star is the ECU flasher. If I click on this ECU flasher, it comes with two options. You can go into read ECU reading and writing option also available and transmission reading and writing option is also available 
it covers both cars and commercials but they mentioned here only cars but need not to worry all the latest commercial vehicle it comes with delphi 7.1 ecus also if you want to see that means you can go for car segment go for ecm click on enter and which model we want we can scroll it each and everything as per the brand as per the ecu type as per the type dump also so here they clearly given all the information about the dcm 7.1 so this is what the DC 7.1 you need to work by bench mode actually this all the image which will going to represent on the bench mode and here is a one more Audi it's a Bosch ME 7.5.10 K line so it supports both OBD circuit along with the bench mode also let's see both 90% of all the models it supports both bench only and here is the Audi Continental it comes with Tricor TC 1797 we need to go by chip level so shall I enter for this one? Let's see what the difference between this image, this image and this image. Click on stat, boot, MP001, click OK. Now it's loading data, but always be sure, please we should have a proper internet for using this device properly. This function is available by connecting a server. Please ensure the internet is connection is normal. Click OK. So here is the information about the dashboard. In this one function is there, hex editor is there, ECU information, read internal flash, read internal EEPROM. Same like KTM bench reading and writing options available. And here is the connect button is available. Before going to start that one, first we should see the guide. So if I click on guide means what all the informations it will show. Let's see one by one. So bench boot ok please ensure the high power DC regulations ok done I am having a 12 volts adapter there is no issue with that the company only given with the best charger for the 12 volts rating and to reading and writing before connections ok operation instructions ok 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 they give a clear information about all the pin nodes and where we need to connect all the step by step locations also they given as per the cable numbers the cable numbers they given here only. So as per the cable numbers, just we need to connect for the ECM. So if you finish all these things means we need to connect for the coupler also. So the coupler connections means it comes with 12 volts, ground, can low, can high, 12 volts, GPD 0, GPD 1 and 12 volts. Same like KTM bench only, but these are the connections we need to do for the internal hardware. So as per the information, this boot mode and bench mode is good and fine. And we need to have a one more device that is MP001. So right now in this product, I'm not getting any MP001. I think we need to purchase this hardware as extra, but need not to worry. It's okay. I'm going back. So we don't want any on the boot mode level. So directly we need to work on bench mode and via OBD mode. These two are more enough for us to solve all the ECU complaints like reading and writing. So let's see first with our Delphi 7.1. So this Delphi 7.1 they clearly mentioned that you can read this ECM data through by bench mode only. So what are the minimum setups we require to read the ECU like Delphi 7.1. So click on this one, click on stat, select on bench. We need to use a adapter that is called P004. So this is the adapter what they recommended for to read and write the data. So let's I am going to select that P004, click OK. Now it's loading data. This function is available by connecting the server. Please ensure the connection is normal. OK, no problem in the internet. Hmm. Now the dashboard is open. Now the dashboard is open. Let's we need to go for the guide. If you click on guide means what all the information they given, everything you there as per the show. We need to connect this from the OBD cable. So first we should have a OBD cable. So this is the OBD cable, just what it's a main cable actually. We need to connect the main cable. And after that we need to use an adapter that is called as P004. So this is called P004. So this P004. And after this connection of P004, we need to connect with a bench cable. So previously while doing unboxing, I clearly showed now this is a bench cable. So if you show like this means it's very easy to understand. First of all, I'm going back and after doing of all the connections go for pinouts also. And the hardware is look like this. It's a Delphi 7.1. 
and this is the second image for the coupler you should do the connection like three wires for the supply two wire for can low can high and one wire for the ground so this much connections to give just only for power supply and communications so i think this much information really easy to work for the users and we are having option like to read the internal flash and to write the external flash really it's very easy to operate this device now you got a clear picture about how to do programming for bench mode obd mode and boot mode also so this product i am recommending only for bench and obd mode only so for doing all this boot mode means slightly it will be like look like difficult for the freshers for experienced person means we need to purchase that adapter so if you have that adapter means definitely you can deal with the boot also now you got a clear picture about what is the meaning of bench what is the meaning of boot and what is the meaning of obd also today i got one complaint from the mahendra customer uh, today i am planning to replace with a new one only I'm using this obd start to replace with a new ecm so this is a bosch edc 17c81 so first we need to start the connection 